What's up guys, my name is Cal. Welcome back to another video with Tease Henley. This one all about foods that cause acne. And I don't know if y'all see this, but that happened because I ate one of these foods that I shouldn't have ate. And you know what they say, a smart person learns from their mistakes, but a genius learns from the mistakes of others. Learn from my mistakes and we're gonna get right into it. The first food you should avoid is high glycemic loaded foods. Now I know what you're thinking, what is a high glycemic loaded food? Well think of it like this. High glycemic loaded foods are fast digesting foods, anything between pasta, white rice, and sugar. And what those fast digesting foods do is that it's basically a mass producer of insulin. And insulin is the start of a bad recipe that doesn't end well. What that does is the insulin acts like a recruiter and it recruits other hormones most commonly the IGF or the insulin like growth factor. Now from there, the IGF activates our sex hormone, androgen, and this androgen is the beginning of the end because it just hits up the sebaceous gland and says, hey, let's spread out more oil throughout the skin. Why not? We just came from the gym, we're already sweaty. Now I'm not saying sweating bad, don't, don't think sweating bad, but just imagine all that extra oil and sweat on your face, that's a recipe for disaster. So make sure you're careful with what you consume because it comes out through your skin. Now, the second food that causes acne is pizza. And yes, that's what happened here. I might have ate a slice or ate. But now I know that dairy does do this to the skin. And it's because of... And after some research, I noticed a study had two different groups consuming dairy products. Group A had full fat dairy products and group B had skim uh, products. Now, group A had a significant uptick in acne and breakouts because it seems to be the fats. So it seems to be that the fats is what cause the acne and breakouts. And not to mention, a lot of these foods, dairy foods, are insulin producers. Now, we spoke about insulin, and another insulin producer can be found in dairy and also your shaker bottle. And your shaker bottle is full of whey protein, which is actually an insulin producer. So be careful with those gainer shakes because it could cause some breakouts and, and you wouldn't even know that it's your actual shaker bottle or the whey protein inside of it. Now the third food that causes acne is sugar. A high sugar intake can cause pimples, blackheads, whiteheads, so make sure you skip your cup of joe. Don't be afraid to change up your diet and eliminate sugars, cereals, anything like that with sugar uh, in it. Do your best to consume foods that aren't added with sugars and if you do want to track it, make sure you stay under 150 calories of sugar. Uh, throughout the day anything over we, we tend to go over that but anything over that would definitely be a significant reason why you're experiencing any type of acne breakouts or blemishes now the fourth acne causing food is starch foods similar to high glycemic loaded foods in which starchy foods like bread pasta rice cereal oats all those things do contribute to acne breakouts and can actually worsen pimples. Now this is especially apparent for anybody with cystic acid, so make sure that we cut down on the starch uh, until we clear up our skin. And I know that's tough for any of us meeting, trying to meet some caloric goals, but we're gonna have to find some alternatives or some healthier alternatives. Uh, that's up to you to find out, but these are the foods that do cause that. So if you do find yourself eliminating these foods but still have bad acne, then I do recommend changing the frequency of your, of your meals in which you eat more frequent. Now, if you do find yourself cutting down on these foods, but you're still not seeing any type of results, then maybe a diet change is due. And what I mean by a diet change, I mean by the frequency of your meals. Maybe you should consume more frequent foods so you can control your appetite and suppress your hunger more, which gives you a less of an impulse to uh, snack on things that you shouldn't be snacking on, <laughs> like this. And then you're gonna subconsciously just stop eating these foods that cause the acne because you're just more in control of your appetite. Therefore, you're gonna need a good face wash and the face wash that's been holding it down for me for quite some time is Teach Hanley's uncomplicated skincare routine because well, it's uncomplicated, it's easy to follow, it doesn't leave your skin looking irritated or inflammated, but it does leave it looking hydrated and radiant. And that's the goal, isn't it? Go about your business with smooth skin, right? Exactly. So for the best results, make sure you wash twice daily, make sure you exfoliate twice weekly, and also apply acne cream if you suffer from severe acne or breakouts. And that is today's video on four foods that cause acne. So make sure you're careful with what you consume because it will come out through your skin and sometimes in the face area. We're trying to avoid that and go about our day with a bunch of confidence and clear skin. So if you're trying to learn any more about T. Chanley's products that does make your skin radiant, click right here, learn more. And with that, thank you for watching. I'm Cal. Till next time.